Hi guys, this is Sorrow. So in the last tutorial, we have learned how we can design this game. Now in this video, we will learn how we can code for this game, right? So let's start the code and go to the block section here and you will see here that's the code we have done. Right. Now we have to move this, uh, this man, this goalkeeper, right? Like this, left to right and right to left, automatic. Okay, we are not going to do here anything. So we will just uh, need to code for it. So how we can code it to move this man automatic. So here's the code. So what we, we can do, we will call here when. So first we need to start the speed. So here you can see, click on the image split to and whenever image split dot to dot age reached you will see here this one just drag and drop this one and before it we have to click on the screen and you will see the when screen one dot in a slide just drag and drop this and start and we have to call here set image split to you will see image split to speed okay set image split to speed and speed something i'm going to make this speed at least 10 okay so i'm going to change this value to 90 to 10 like this okay so whenever image split to reach the age it means here and here in this in this position so we have to move it in the opposite direction right so we will code for it we will use here conditions so you will see here in the control option if else condition just drag and drop this if else then click on the maths and you will find this option here equal just drag and drop this if image is split to dot x it means this x position is should be greater than 190 how we can find it just click on this image split and you will see here 134 if i just drag this image here it means 207 it means this image x value is greater than 190 then we will move it in the opposite direction in it means in this, this direction okay left direction so just code for it click on the image 2 okay and you will find the image 2 dot x image split 2 dot x and the value should be greater so that one is greater sign if greater than 190 just copy this number and paste here is 190 then we have to move in the opposite direction so we just need to call just copy this set image split dot speed should be in the minus 10 like this and if so we have to use another condition if else else if condition just drag and drop this else if here and just copy this condition again paste it here if image split dot x value is is less than should be 20 so how we can find this 20 you will see here if i just move it in this uh, positions you will see 21 right so whenever the x value is less than 20 so we have to move it in the opposite direction again right so just call this set image split but dot speed and this should be plus like this okay so let's let's see how it's work so you can see here screen is in a slice and this one is start moving right like this now we have to code for the collide option right if this ball is collide with this goalkeeper it means game is over right but if this wall is not collide with this goalkeeper it means uh, we can increase the uh, uh, goal value or we can increase the score something like that okay because we have done the one goal right so let's see whenever so we have to code for it so whenever image spread to dot collide with so you will see click on image spread and you will see find your collide with option like this then 
again we have to use here if l condition go to the control and just drag and drop this if and this cop click on max and you will see here this one option equal just copy this and just click on the other and just get other if the get other equal to ball right this one ball so click on ball and you will find your ball option like this and drag and drop this ball here if other equal to ball then set we have to increase the uh, value right so how we can do this so uh, if the ball collide with not this man uh, with this uh, uh, neat it means we have done the goal okay so click on this image split one okay fine so just fix this one change this image speed one if image speed one collide with the ball it means we have done one goal so we have to increase the value so we have to define here one score uh, block section which is drag and drop one label here and change this background color or something or uh, make this one text color at least white and make font size is at least 20 right and change this text to zero fine now now I'll go to the block section so we have to set we have to increase the value it means that one is our score right so set level one dot text like this here okay and click on the maths again just drag and drop this one and click on the level one and you will find the level one dot text this one just drag and drop here and just click on this value here and just use here one it means we have we are going to, we are increasing here one value okay so make this one no 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 this should be plus one uh, so click on maths and you'll find here a plus option this one right and this should be here and this should be here just delete this one and drag and drop here fine now let's uh, let's uh, we have to we have to uh, move this ball in from here to here right so let's re uh, click on the ball and you will find your set ball speed so we have to make our ball speed should be zero okay we have you will find your right set ball speed this one like here and just copy this one and paste here okay and make it zero like this and right and we have to move our ball also so click on ball and you will find here a call move like this and ball position in a slice position is 153 and 294 153 and 294 okay it means just copy this one this one and this one 154 x value is 153 and y value is 294 294 right fine now now if the ball is not collide with the uh, neat okay so it means go no, the game is over because uh, because we have we haven't done the code we have haven't done the goal that's why okay so let's let's uh, click on the label and you will find a set label text this one so just click on this setting option and just drag and drop else and just drag and drop here this one and make this text should be game over and make this one game over and make this ball position again here and make this ball speed also zero okay right here so I'm going to use here else if again okay like this and use it in the 
then option remove this else and we have to do one coding here right so uh, the coding should be if if so i'm going to paste copy this one like this if uh, i'm going to close again and i'm going to make here if the ball dot x value it means that one is uh, 153 if i just make this ball here it means their y value is 101 and here wall value is 284 it means the y value should be increased so wall click on wall and wall 1 dot y if the ball 1 dot y value is greater than less than sorry less than and just use your some number copy paste this one here and just make it 100 right okay let's run this app we have to just click on this ball to make a goal right fine we have done one goal and score is one right let's see if i'm going to click on again oh that one is also goal okay the, uh, so there are a lot of things are working right now so tomorrow we will finish this app and make some more advanced thing in this app okay so thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe my channel for more updates have a nice day be safe bye bye